So the U-arm has arrived. Um, exquisitely packed with every little bag of components labeled with every component in it and the instructions are amazing so assembling it took a while because it's a lot of little screws and bearings and things but it's just like Lego it really is so that just took about an afternoon and now we can test the arm and see if it can do what we wanted to so we'll make it pick up a little frying basket out of a pot Halle designed a little carousel that fits inside the frying pot and I made these little baskets just by hand and with sugru and uh, we're gonna see if uh, the robot can turn the carousel by pushing these little nibs that stick out. It's not going so well, so well but uh, we could enlarge the, the nibs into plates so that, that it won't ever miss them that's a way to go you can also just um, use the handles of the baskets to turn okay let's just turn it whoa whoa, whoa no 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 wait wait oh I'm, it. okay i have to turn it the, the wrong way compared to my perspective <laughs> okay okay just in no no wait that's the way that's the way yes why are you raising yourself up oh okay you have to turn as well so you don't lose the grip oh you lost the grip okay well um it's possible Come on. Come on. Oh. No, no, no. Wait, oh. We're going to need some more testing of that. Well, uh, we can see that the arm does what it has to do, the main thing, which is turn the carousel and uh, pick up the individual segments with the donuts uh, and put them where they can be frosted and ejected into the customer. I mean, uh, yeah. So, the next thing is to hold on. Uh, program it uh, in the Arduino environment using the coordinates that you get in real time in the mouse control program from U-Factory. So, let's see how that goes. <laughs> 